guys, welcome back. It's been a little while. It's been a little too long, but welcome back to episode uh, 17 on the Enderman server. And we are now currently, <coughs> oh, excuse me, we are on, in, around the player shop area tonight, today. And uh, we took a tour of the player shops once, but I just figured we'd come by here and take a look at what... Hmm. Okay, that's uh, an odd shop. Uh, we just stop in and take a look and see what is new. Uh, stables are empty. Got... Oh, okay. Not sure whose shop this is anymore, but okay. And we've got a shop up here. Arctic Cat. And he sells wheat. And looks like food. And we've got PRK's shop. And he sells nothing the everything store with tiny big gimmish ooh nice rug mob items minerals upper floor music and horse everything okay continuing on we have a pit in the floor belongs to scholar i bet you he's doing this on uh it's on it's in progress i'm sure coyotes clays for days hey check it out very nice. <laughs> yeah, that's great. Has anyone ordered anything? Nope, no orders. Okay. And then we've got Alexei's shop. Seeds, reeds. Okay. More of the same. Redstone shop. Blaze rods and redstone. Okay. This is Slee's shop. Alright. Very nice. We have Babber's shop. Downtown gets very dangerous at night. Uh, but Babber sells just about everything. She have a burglar in the house. Hey, buddy. You don't belong in here after hours. There you go, Babbers. I killed your burglar. Uh, do we have the library? Which, I'm not sure what you buy in here. Want to Skype? Uh... So we got the library, Tiny McGimish, and looks like super enchanting. Very cool. Let's back up to the surface. Do, 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 do. Library is very cool. Tiny's Weapons Shop and Bane's Armor Shop. Uh, so you can buy all these weapons. Uh, you can buy swords, iron and diamond swords, bows, arrows. Uh, okay. Who's in here? It's just this uh, dangerous city. Flash's Bulk Buy Cave. Now, we've been on this server since the beginning as well, and we don't have a player shop. So I think we should build one. But what do we have to sell? Swords. Lots and lots of swords. Because we have our pig farm that is doing fantastic. That 
was awesome. Did that guy make me lose the armor? My shoes are gone. Mm. We'll have to fix that. Um, I should have brought a bed, perhaps. All right, we're going to get some daytime going, and we will be back in just a second. All right, so daytime is now upon us, and this is, is the site of our shop. And we are going to call it Lord's Swords and Snack Shop. We will sell the gold swords we have, and we will sell steaks. So I think that's a pretty good idea. Now, we are going to sell... So what we're going to do is we are going to sell the unenchanted gold swords for in-game economy money and then we are going to sell the enchanted swords uh, as a trade for an item and we'll set up some trading system with hoppers and chests and uh, they'll be able to throw something in there and it will then uh, maybe let's say they throw in a diamond and then they'll randomly get an enchanted sword of some kind perhaps or Maybe, I don't know, we'll find some way of determining what the payment would be. I think a diamond would be fair, because some of them have some pretty good enchants. Um, I saw some that had looting and knockback, fire aspect. I had one that was a solid 30 enchant sword. Hey, creeper man. There you go. And uh, so I started... Just a little bit. I brought over some furnaces and some chests with some stuff. And uh, loaded them all up with a bunch of charcoal. And I believe the theme I'm going to go for this is going to be uh, castle themed. So we're going to have um, cobble and um, cobblestone, smooth stone, um, brick, stone brick all wrapped up in this thing and uh, we're gonna make it uh, we're probably gonna throw some wood in there and make it an overall pretty good I think pretty good so uh, let's go ahead and get some of this cobble going whoa someone is not happy where is he oh there he is what you get don't you know me I'm the spider slayer buddy spider slayer you can't touch this can't touch this do 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 can't touch this okay you guys are probably way too young to know that let's see we got uh, two four six eight ten twelve furnaces one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve stacks Let's uh, get them fired up. All right. Now, being that we're in the very back <clears throat> of the player shops, we're going to need a way for people to know that we're back here. Um, the entrance of player shops is way over there, and we are, again, back here and around the corner, and we're going to need a way to stand out. And I have an idea, and we can actually start on that idea, well, I'm not sure if we should start it now or if we should wait until we get some of this built. Hmm. Well, let's um let's just do this. Let's grab some cobble and we will draw our wall across um Well, that's not the cobble I grabbed. There we go. 
Doot, 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 doot. Anyone else hear that? Okay. Now, we're probably going to have to, even though our edge of our property goes all the way to here for our shop, we're probably going to bring in the, t the turret to over here to right to this area like this let's well, even oh oops hold on a minute we're out too far oh boy we're gonna have to move a furnace now well I really did not think did I uh, well let's see this way if that's there and we go like that, and then it goes there, and like that, and then there, and then, yeah, these are in the way. We can move them in a moment. That's no big deal. Alrighty. So we don't really need all the space that we're gonna that I get that I got that I gave that I go that I go, and I do not speak English today. Like that, and right there, and then right there, and that's actually our our circle. Okay, but this is all on the outside, and those are. Ah, oh, what did I do? What the? Hmm. Well, let me. Hmm. See, I'm not very good at planning some of this stuff, it seems. That's there. That's all outside there. That means this wall belongs right here instead. Oh, that's right. I pulled it back. I should pull back the whole circle then. Gosh. Hmm. So we should be going like this. Um All that should be That was like that I think that's where I had it before wasn't it yeah see that's inside too much I don't know maybe that'd be cool I could bring this one over I'm like constantly shrinking this space uh, but here's what I'll do <clears throat> excuse me how about I go ahead and work on this just a little bit and get these satisfied and you guys go ahead and take a commercial break and when we come back uh, I will have our towers laid out and our the rest of our square walls laid out and then we can go ahead and work on the player our player shop just a little bit Lord's Swords all right we'll see you guys in just a moment All right, guys, <clears throat> we're back, and I think I got a layout satisfactory to what I would like. So let's take a look here. So from the ground, just be a regular wall. I mean, you'll, it'll look like a castle. You'll actually walk up here and into one of the towers. So this is going to go up and then arch over and then come down. Uh, we'll walk inside and then we'll have everything laid out in here and then of course these towers which have minimal Internal will just be big empty towers. I'll probably light them up just so we don't get a bunch of mobs spawning in there Same with over this side. I push this wall back in comparison to the other side just so we can have a little more room But again, these will be sealed off, but they'll be up tall uh, I had to of course move stuff around I might open these up. I'm not sure yet. It, we'll have to see how big the place looks once we get everything going. So let's go ahead and make some brick here and just start uh, 
put some of this away. Boy, I tell you what, that charcoal machine has paid for itself over and over and over again in just the amount of time it has saved. All right. You know, I don't have to look for coal. So let's do this. Let's go and yeah, we'll go ahead and just round this out. Unlike the walls that we did back at the house, the fortress walls, uh, I'm actually going to probably, st I'm going to, st my initial plans are to stagger some smooth stone along with the not so smooth stone with the brick in these towers. Maybe I'll go on a hunt for some cracked brick, maybe some mossy brick to put in here too. Let's see how that feels. That's with all the extra equipment in here, it's hard to tell. Um, well, I'll probably end up knocking out at least this one because this feels really tight. Yeah, let's. That looks good, yeah. Maybe we can get some. We'll we'll decorate the interior pretty elaborately so it looks really nice. Maybe get some red carpet to lay down. <clears throat> Maybe out here on the side of the building, put some colored wool with an L and a G on it. Get some purple and some yellow, uh, some purple and some gold color. Yeah, we're gonna open these up. I kind of think we need to at this point. So this is pretty much it. This is going to be the beginning of Lord Swords. Um, one thing we do need to do though is we need to get our sign up so people even know we're back here. So let's clear out our inventory here real quick. Because I have something already in mind for what we need. And maybe by looking at this, you can already tell. And we are going to... I should have kept some cobble. We are going to go out here. And we are going to put it, where does our property end? Ow! Son of, where is he? Anything good? No, just a bone. Oh, this is going to be difficult. I am going to go find a bed. Um... Anyone have a bed here? A bed? Anyone? I'll tell you what, again, we'll make it daytime and be right back.
All right. We're back to daytime. And let's go ahead and get our sign built. And we're going to put it... I hear someone. What the what? Our property ends here. Let's bound up. Uh, this should work. And let's do this. And some of you may already know what I'm building here. Then we've got like that. There we go. Okay. No, I think I want this to be pointing up. Oh, that's going to be a long drop. Ah, uh, biscuits. Okay. I hear you, skeleton. I hear you. Yeah, I want that wood facing upward. I want the dark wood facing to the sides. I want all of those facing upward. Okay. Then we put our wool here and and depending on how long this takes will determine if we leave it all in or if I cut some out. Oh, that's the wrong color wool. Yeah, see, I'm not real great at this, but we'll get it. We'll get through it. Bear with me. Yep. Thanks. Wool for nothing. It's not the right color. There we go. Supposed to be black. There and there. And then yellow right there. Let me see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-twenty-two, forty-twenty-three, forty-twenty-four, forty-twenty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-twenty-two, forty-twenty-three, forty-twenty-four, forty-twenty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-twenty-two, forty-twenty-three, forty-twenty-four, forty-twenty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-twenty-two, forty-twenty-three, forty-twenty-four, forty-twenty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-twenty-two, forty-twenty-three, forty-twenty-four, forty-twenty-five,
I do know that this then goes out to like this and up to like this. I believe. Yeah. Take a look here. Let's see if we go. Well, Hmm. Well, I tell you what, let me go ahead and do a little bit more work on this. Uh, we're a little slow going. Uh, let me get it finished up and we'll come straight away back. All right, thanks. All right, here we are. Done. I'm sure you already know what it is that we made. Oh, boy. Uh, yeah, probably should have put some torches on it. Let's go out to the end. It's dangerous. Whew. Okay, let's knock all this down. Our scaffolding. Where are ya? More wool down here. You know, I built this on my own property at back at the house. And I thought I'd brought just enough to get me through. I guess I was mistaken. Huh. Odd. Okay, well anyway. Let's uh, back up and take a look. I'm sure you could... Oh, we can't look. Yeah, let's just... I'm sure you can already guess by now what we made. But let's just take a look. Yes! The sword of power, and it is glorious. Let's see how that looks from the entrance here now. So when you first enter the player shops, can you see it? No. Ah, uh, hmm. Maybe we should do something more. You're walking along. Do, 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 do. Whoa, what's that? It's a giant golden sword. Let's go take a look. That is amazing. Oh, shh! No way! Wow. Good thing we have uh, mob grief turned off. What is this? It is Lord Swords and Snack Shop coming soon. How super cool is that? <laughs> light this puppy up so that is where we're gonna be for now and I will work on this more later but that's it that's the beginning of Lord Swords so guys I hope you enjoyed the episode it was a uh, kind of buildy but I hope it was good for you as it was for me if you did like it please leave a thumbs up oh geez and leave comments. That way I know that you guys are watching. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what's taking you so long to do it? So guys, this has been Lord Gigabyte. And until next time. Let me see here. There we go. Alright, so this has been Lord Gigabyte guys. And until next time. So long.